welcome back to Linus Wednesdays, where we look at Linus tips and tricks on a Wednesday. In this week's video, we're going to be looking at Caden Live. I'm going to show you how you can add text to your pictures and videos in Caden Live. So if we open up Caden Live, and we're going to start a new project, and I'm going to drag the video to the timeline. Now what I want to do now is I want to mute the audio track here. So if I'm going to go to effects, and type in mute. And drag mute to there, and that's muting the track there. And what this is, is a video that was taken Sunday. And I was playing around with a video camera, trying to zoom in on the moon. Couldn't see the moon because it just wasn't out, it was too cloudy. But we did find, like, this weird thing in the sky. If I go forward a bit, you see there, that's what we found. Can we go full screen that one? There you go. That's what we found in the sky. And I don't know what that was. Is it PIR lights? I don't know. I don't know what that is, what we found in the sky. But you see the camera, it's got a hell of a zoom. So let's go forward a bit. You see there, we've zoomed out. What I want to do, I want to add some text to the video. So if I click on Project Bin, press the down arrow, we're going to go to Title Clip. You'll see here this box appears. Now if you don't see the image behind there, just click on Show Background there. Now you can see the image uh, the image in the background or the video. Now what I need to do now is make sure it's on the T and I can click it and then I can type in my text. Let's have a look. Just do. Now you see there it's a bit too big. I can then highlight it by triple clicking. I'll make it smaller using the mouse wheel. There you go. And then I can then just position it where I want it to there and we're going to go on create title now we just drag that title to the video and you can make it as long as you want so make it go there so when it plays now you'll see there it plays in the video you see where i'm zooming in with the camera now it starts it just looks a bit ready when it comes up now it's gone back to a whitish color to, when it looks red on the video camera when you watch it through the viewfinder Maybe I want it to start halfway through. So I can click here. I can drag that to there. I can drag that one to, say, there. And then you play it again. And the um, text comes on the screen. What I can do, if I delete the text, and we go File, and we're going to go to Title Clip, and we do the text again. Okay, move it into the middle. Now maybe I want to add like a rectangle around that. If I click here, and it's saying, hey, you've got the rectangle, and I'm going to do a solid colour. Let's leave it as red for this one. You can click there, and you can pick any colour. We can do gradient, and I can just literally draw over the text. You'll see there, drawn over the text, let's move it up a bit, make it a bit smaller. You'll see, now it's covered up the text. Now either I can just drag it up there, and go the other way around and drag the text onto to there but it's not going to go on there let's drag that down what i can do now is use one of these buttons here and we can bring it to the front there we go that's brought the the red box i can still with the red box with the text there and i can click on create title let's drag that to our timeline and there we go we got ourselves a nice red box that appears on the screen there now maybe i want it to do i know appear like to fade on fade off i can click on the arrow on the top here and let's change that to uh and that will fade on and fade off there we go see it like fade in And slowly fade out but what i can actually do if i hold the control button down and we zoom into the timeline get rid of these i can click say on the bottom here and you've got the wipe effect and i've got wipe method and we can get away curtain there do that one again bring it down a bit right there wipe method and we will do um let's do curtain again now when it plays, so just control go zoom out the timeline, when it plays now, you'll see there, 
it's gone up like a curtain effect. It's gone down. Now if I want to click on there, and I can invert it if I want to. Now when it comes, it come down. It should come down. Here we go. Things a bit too fast. I can then adjust it. There we go. And then let it zoom out. Now I can just change all these effects here. Let's try this one here to burst. That's what that looks like. There we go. Zoom out, there you go, it's gone again. You're not limited to just, if I double click, just a, a box over there. You can add an image if you want to. We can add a, a rectangle and so on. If you go to text, you can do a solid color. So let's uh, delete our text. And delete our effects. We'll start a new one, go new, title clip. And we'll do text, click here. Click away and we drag it in the middle there. I can then change this as a gradient color. And you can then fill around with the gradient colors. So let's go, let's, let's make it bigger. There you go, I can make a gradient. I can click down there, the gradient one. So that's two different colors there. I can press there and I can change it here as well. There you go, let's press OK on that one. There we go. It's a bit different. Let's change it to gradient. Yeah, let's do it again. Press OK. You see there, you can already see the text there now. But we go back to a solid colour. And if you wanted to add a border, you can add an outline to the text as well. So I'll show you that one. Let's delete our video. We're going to go to um, New Colour Clip. Make it 10 seconds long. Drag it down to the timeline. And we're going to do, we're going to do some text. We're going to go to that one. And new title clip. We're going to do that. What's this? And we'll make it a bit bigger. Triple click it. And we're going to do you can do it gradient and we can add you can outline the gradient there we go you can also add a shadow as well if you wanted to there you go is it going to do the shadow or do the offset there you go you can see there looks all right we're adding shadows now to the text you can change all the stuff here now you're not limited to just gradient colors and stuff like that you can do far more with this program i can click on here i can make a Leave it, leave it like that one and then we'll go there and we'll put it back in what's this there you go now you can do far more in this text box that i'm going to show you than i'm going to show you in this video that's how you basically create text titles on caden live just adding text to your videos you can even go here you can download new templates i think it's on caden uh, live store or kde store or something like that get new templates for different um, effects for text if you found the video some use not to do give it a thumbs up if you don't like the video the other button seems to work too as always, thank you very much for watching this Caden Live tutorial for Linux Wednesdays. I'll see you in the next video.